This case is prepared by USMLETutoring.com. It will discuss erectile dysfunction case. Step 2 CS Cases Erectile Dysfunction in 62 Years Old Male Case Scenario Mr. Edward Radovic, a 62 years old male, comes to clinic with complaining of erectile dysfunction. Vitals Temperature is 98.2 Fahrenheit. Heart rate is 76 per minute, regular. Respiratory rate is 14 per minute. Blood pressure is 130 over 74 millimeters of mercury. Oxygen saturation is 98% on room air. Let's review differential diagnosis it could be due to Diabetes mellitus Medication induced Psychogenic Neurogenic Primary gonadal failure endocrinological Let's review key points before entering patient's room. You should have patient's name, chief complaint and vital signs. Please have a differential diagnosis before entering room so you can ask specific questions. Patient might be shy about talking of his erectile dysfunction, so please make him comfortable and reassure him so he can speak about it. Position of the patient. The patient will be sitting on bed. He might be shy initially to talk about his erectile dysfunction. How to make patient comfortable. Address patient by his last name, shake hands and introduce yourself. Explain him what you are going to do in next 15 minutes. Offer help, if they need during history taking and physical examination. Reassure and explain him for any of his concerns. Reiterate that all information will be kept confidential. Opening of the case Mr. Radulovic, good morning. I am Dr. Kendall. I am an attending physician in this hospital. Shake hand. Today I will take care of you. First I will ask you a few questions and do brief physical examination. Meanwhile if you have any questions, feel free to ask me. Let me make you comfortable. Drape patient at this time. Okay, Doc. Please tell me what brought you in today? Doc, I have problem with my sexual life. Please tell me what kind of problem you have. Doc, I do not have enough erection anymore. Tell me how long you have been having this problem? Doc, about last six months. Do you see any changes over last six months? It's getting worse. Do you have sexual desire? Yes, Doc, I always want to have sex, but because of this problem I can't enjoy it. Mr. Radulovic, I can understand how difficult this problem is. I will try my best to help you. Thank you, Doc. Do you have difficulty in initiating erection? Yes, Doc. It takes long time. Can you maintain erection? Yes, but for shorter time period. Do you have any difficulty in ejaculation? Yes. Doc, I sometimes have early ejaculation. Can you achieve orgasm? Yes, I can. Do you have erections in the night or early morning? Yes, I do. Do you have any weakness in legs? No, Doc. Do you have any numbness or tingling in legs? No, Doc. Do you have any pain in legs while you walk? No, Doc. Do you have any chest pain? No, Doc. Have you noticed any changes in urination? No, Doc. 
It's good. Have you noticed any changes in bowel movements? No duck. Do you have any conflicts with your partner? No duck. She is very understandable. Have you had any injury to back? No duck. Here, you should use transition sentence. Mr. Radulovic, I would like to ask you a few questions about your health in the past. Okay, Doc. Do you have high blood pressure? Yes, Doc. I take hydrochlorothiazide 25 mg and Atanol 50 mg daily. Is it controlled? Yes, I check it regularly, and it is about 130, over 85. Do you have high blood sugar? Yes, Doc, I am taking metformin 1000 mg two times a day. Is it controlled? Doc, not really, I check it occasionally, and most of the times it is above 200. I see. Do you have high blood cholesterol? Yes, I take Lipitor 20 mg at bedtime. Do you have any other medical conditions? No, Doc. Do you have any surgery? Yes, I had prostectomy two years back. Medications. Apart from the medications you told me, do you take any other medications? Anything herbal or Chinese or over-the-counter? No, Doc. Allergy. Do you have any allergy? No, Doc. Social history. Mr. Radulovic, now I would like to ask you a few questions about your habits. Okay, Doc. Do you smoke? I used to smoke half pack per day for last 20 years. But I quit it three years back. Take this opportunity to appreciate patients' smoking cessation. I appreciate that you quit smoking. It will help you. Do you take alcohol? Occasionally. Do you take any recreational drugs? No, Doc. Sexual history. Now, I would like to ask you a few personal questions. I assure you that all information will be kept confidential. As you mentioned, you have been sexually active with your wife. Have you had any other partner recently? No, Doc. Only my wife. Family history. Now, let me ask you a few questions about health of your family members. Does anybody in your family have any medical conditions? Yes, Doc, my father died due to heart attack five years back when he was 80 and my mom died due to breast cancer when she was 72. I'm sorry to hear that. It's okay, Doc. Occupational history. What kind of work do you do? I work as a regional manager at insurance company. Summarization of history in two to three sentences. Now you are done with history. It's time to summarize it. Mr. Radulovic, thank you. I am done with history. Let me summarize it. As you mentioned, you have difficulty in initiating and maintaining erection for last six months that is getting worse with occasional premature ejaculations. Challenging question. Do you have any question? Doc, I have seen that of Viagra. Can you prescribe it for me, please? Mr. Radulovic, I appreciate that you are aware of Viagra. That is good medication for problem like this, but I need to examine you and make sure that it is right for you. Okay, Doc. Points to remember before starting physical examination. Wash your hands. Always make patient comfortable. Ask permission to examine. Do not repeat painful maneuvers.
Use proper draping techniques. Provide help during examination. Explain what you are doing. Focus examination. Mr. Radulovic, now I need to examine you. May I proceed? Please do focused physical examination. General examination, do it quick. Head, ear, eye, nose and throat, carotid bruit. Respiratory system, inspection, auscultation. Cardiovascular system, inspection, auscultation. GI, mention genital examination and parectal examination in diagnostic workup. Extremities, check pulse, motor and sensory function of lower extremity. Central nervous system. How to finish case. Once you are done with your physical, give him initial impression and explain your plan. Mr. Radulovic, thank you for your cooperation. I am done with physical examination. Let me give my impression. Based on your history and my physical examination, it seems that you might have decreased blood supply to penis or nerve damage to it. But it could be something else. So, to arrive at right diagnosis, I will run some blood tests and order imaging study, such as ultrasound of the penis. Once I have result we will meet again and discuss various treatment options. Do you have any questions? No duck. Shake hands and leave the room. Patient note. History. A 62 years old male came to clinic with chief complaint of not having enough erection for last six months that is getting worse. It takes long time to have erection that lasts short period of time. It is associated with occasional early ejaculation. He has good sexual desire and achieved sexual orgasm. He also has nighttime erections. He denied any numbness, weakness or pain in legs, back injury, urinary and bowel complaints or appetite changes. He also denied any chest pain, sob and conflicts with partner. Review of system, negative except as above. Past medical history, hypertension, hyperlipemia, diabetes mellitus. Past surgical history, prostatectomy two years ago. Medications. Hydrochlorothiazid 25 mg daily. Adenolol 50 mg daily. Metformin 1 gram two times a day. Lipitor 20 mg daily. All, none. No known drug allergy. Social history. Used to smoke half pack per day for 20 years. Quit three years back. Occasional drinker. No recreational drugs. Lives with wife and sexual active with wife only. Works as regional manager at insurance company. Family history. Father died at age of 80 due to heart attack. Mother died at 72, due to breast cancer. Physical examination. Vitals, within normal limit. General, well-oriented elderly male, sitting on the bed, without any acute distress. Head, ear, eye, nose and throat, pupils equal, round, reactive to light and accommodation. External ocular movement intact, no pallor, icterus, lymphadenopathy and carotid bruit. Respiratory system, clear to auscultation, no additional sounds. Cardiovascular system, S1 and S2 regular rate rhythm, no murmur, rubs and gallops. Abdomen, soft and non-distended, non-tender, breath sounds present. No organomegaly. Extremity, no edema, bilateral pulse present. Central nervous system, alert and oriented to person, place, 
and time, motor, 5 by 5 in lower extremity and sensory, bilateral equal. Data interpretation. Diagnosis 1. Erectile dysfunction secondary to diabetes mellitus. History findings. 1. Progressive erectile dysfunction for last 6 months. 2. Normal sexual desire. 3. Uncontrolled and long-standing diabetes mellitus. 4. Other risk factors, hypertension, hyperlipidemia and smoking history. Diagnosis 2. Erectile dysfunction secondary to atherosclerosis. History findings. 1. Progressive erectile dysfunction. 2. Normal sexual desire. 3. Risk factors for atherosclerosis, uncontrolled and long-standing diabetes mellitus, hypertension, hyperlipidemia, advanced age and smoking. Diagnosis 3. Medication-induced erectile dysfunction. History findings. 1. Gradual onset and worsening of erectile dysfunction in last 6 months. 2. Use of hydrochlorothiazid and atinolol. 3. Additional risk factors, uncontrolled diabetes mellitus, hypertension, hyperlipidemia, advanced age and smoking. Diagnostic studies. 1. Genital and rectal examination. 2. Complete blood count with differential. 3. Basic metabolic panel, hemoglobin A1c. 4. Serum testosterone, prolactin. 5. Penile Doppler ultrasound. Additional diagnoses. You might consider additional diagnoses based on patient's presentation. Here we have also included possible history and physical examination findings for them. It would be helpful when you have a little bit different presentation than it was mentioned in this case. Data Interpretation Diagnosis Erectile Dysfunction Secondary to Prostatectomy History Findings 1. Sudden onset of erectile dysfunction. 2. Recent history of prostatectomy. 3. Normal sexual desire. 4. Absence of other etiology. Diagnosis. Hypogonadism. History Findings. 1. Gradual onset of erectile dysfunction. 2. Decrease libido. 3. Fatigue, hot flashes, depressed mood. 4. Gynecomastia. Physical exam findings. 1. Gynecomastia. Diagnosis. Psychogenic erectile dysfunction. History findings. 1. Erectile dysfunction with particular partner. 2. Normal libido. 3. Nocturnal erection present. 4. Conflicts with partner. We wish you happy reading.